Welcome to part 3 on the tutorial of how to make a website. So let's sign back into sgis.co.uk. Remember this is the low cost hosting company that we found. It's relatively easy to install WordPress as you found in the next step, in the last step. And in this step what we're going to do is configure WordPress. So click on manage hosting again. Click on uh, the new um, website that you registered, whatever your domain name is. And then you're here in the control panel. We're going to need uh, the mailbox name. So let's just go back to your mailbox and uh, select this, pass um, this email address here. So select it and right click and copy. That will copy the text. Now to get back into um, WordPress you need to enter your domain name then a forward slash WP for WordPress dash admin press enter hopefully it's remembered my password it's not remembered the password so to get the password if you go back to the page to manage your hosting go into your webmail select your mailbox log in and you should find an email from WordPress with the password so let's select that password copy that paste it into here click on remember and log in okay so now now we're back into WordPress so what we want to do next is uh, just go into settings for a moment and here we've got the blog title that's okay but the tagline is not let's put something here like um, friendly home visits will appointments you can always change that later save changes on that page and also on the um, permalinks page just want to change that from the default where the pages are just a number to month and name where the post name appears so let's save that as well so we've just changed permalinks to month and name you, you see what I mean about that in a moment so the next thing we're going to do is the appearance let's go to add new themes in appearance let's look at the newest themes okay so now let's have a look through these themes and find one that's going to be suitable for a will writing website okay this one looks this one looks quite good here quite simple okay I quite like this one here I think the ones that tend to work best are black text on a white background let's just check the ones that are featured let's see which one um, jumps out this one's quite good here. Uh, let's try this one for now. You can always change them, it's very easy to change them. Just click on install, then install again, and then on activate. If we visit our site, here we can see um, what it will look like. It looks quite good I think, quite good for a will writing website so now it's a matter of changing the content
before we change the content let's just install a couple more plugins that we're going to need later. So click on the plugins on the left then install plugins on the top and search for XML sitemap and you, you've got Google XML sitemaps. You're going to want to install that. This plugin notifies Google of changes to your website. So click on activate. Another one that we want, click on add new, is called ping optimizer with a Z. Let's look for the correct one. Okay, it's this one, CBNet Ping Optimizer. So install that. This prevents WordPress from unnecessarily pinging the search engines. You don't want to ping them too often. You do want to ping them to let them know that your website's updated, but not too often. So that's a good one. We're also going to want to install Contact Form 7. So type in Contact Form 7, search plugins, and here it is, contact form 7. Let's install that. And activate. And one last one, install plugins again, is called, uh, let's just search for SEO. The all in one SEO pack, so install that. SEO means search engine optimization. This one's quite useful. So activate that. This one must be configured, so click on the admin page. Okay, I've previously donated, so click on, on that. Plugin enabled. Then enter the homepage title. So this is I could put actually Southwest London Wills. Wool Writing Company covering the South West. London friendly professional home visits up until 9 pm in the evening and then keywords wills will writer will writing will writers uh, probate inheritance tax and you could type in Probably eight keywords is the ideal amount, so we could could put South West London as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, SW London. Okay, eight. You can leave the rest as it is. Click on Update Options, and that's it. We've installed some plugins. We've chosen an appearance for our website, and the next stage is to actually get some content on there. So join me in the next video and I'll show you how to add some content to your new website.